There's a dashboard for every repository that Deep Source Analysis is active on, which serves as the single source of truth for your code help. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the basics. The Overview tab gives you a quick view of your repository's code help. Here you'll see how many issues of each category DeepSource detected in your code, along with the total number of active and prevented issues. You'll also see powerful insights, security reports, and historical trends to help you visualize how your repository is doing in terms of key metrics. The Issues tab collates all the code health issues that are currently present in the default branch of this repository. This is the most interesting and actionable tab in the dashboard. On the left, you can see the breakup of all the issues by category. The Recommended tab collates the most critical issues that you might want to tackle right away. In the main section, you'll see the individual issues. Each card shows you the issue's title, category, and the total number of occurrences of this issue in the repository. You can filter this list by issue category or by the analyzer. When you click on any of these issues, you'll see all the occurrences of this issue, where it exists in the code base, and some contextual code to make sense of it. On the right, there's a detailed description of this issue. This description is helpful if you haven't seen this issue before, and it'll help you figure out how to fix it. The Metrics tab shows you all the key metrics of your code. These charts show you how the metric has changed over time and if they are above or below the defined threshold. The Reports tab helps you track security vulnerabilities in your source code and infrastructure's code based on OWASP Top 10 Security Risks and SANS Top 25 Most Dangerous Software Errors. It also gives you insights into the detected issues and issue distribution with interactive charts. These reports can be exported and shared with key stakeholders so that they understand the code quality and maintainability of your organization. The History tab is where you can track all the deep source analysis runs in the repository. Each entry shows the affected branch, the latest commit analyzed, the number of newly introduced issues, and the issues resolved from the last run. You can take action on active pull requests or view historical data. The Settings tab allows you to tailor your analysis specific to the repository. This is where you can regenerate configuration, edit your .deepsource.toml file, control what categories of issues are reported, assign issue priority, set up your third-party integrations, and so much more. 